Hello, this is Dr. Jack Jacobs. I'm the President and Chief Science Officer of Zicha Genesis Medicine. Zicha means life in Ukrainian, and we are a biotechnology company headquartered in Las Vegas, Nevada, developing drugs to treat neurodegenerative brain disorders such as Parkinson's disease and ALS or motor neuron disease. Today, I'm pleased to announce that we plan to start compassionate use clinical trials in the Caribbean. These will start in April of this year. Uh, we are now seeking approval in two island nations and hope to add two additional islands uh, in a few months. Now, we've been collaborating with researchers in Minnesota. These are pioneers uh, in delivering protein drugs into the brains using uh, intranasal delivery. And we've just gotten the results of some exciting experiments they performed for us in animals where they delivered FGF1, our medicine, uh, into the brains of animals through the intranasal delivery route. And remarkably, more than twice the amount of FGF1 gets into the brain using the intranasal route when comparing it to the intravenous or IV route. As shown here, the researchers determined that FGF1 gets into the brain through two major routes, through the olfactory nerve, which is how we smell, and the trigeminal nerve is shown here. Olfactory nerve delivers the FGF to the frontal parts of the brain. Uh, through the trigeminal nerve, we get it into deeper areas of the brain, including the substantia nigra, which becomes dysfunctional in Parkinson's disease, and into the motor cortex area of the brain, which becomes dysfunctional in ALS. Now, the device we'll be using uh, in our clinical trials in the Caribbean is manufactured by a Seattle-based company. A very simple device. You deflect this black knob, and a metered dose of FGF1 is delivered into the nasal cavity, and then with two minutes of normal breathing, the FGF1 uh, gets into the brain. So we're very excited about starting these uh, clinical trials in the Caribbean, first with Parkinson's disease, uh, second with ALS motor neuron disease, and then we'll be adding Alzheimer's disease as well as subjects that have stroke disabilities. There'll be a lot of activity in the coming months. I'm gonna be giving two Zoom webinars, the first one February 1st, 3 p.m. Pacific time, be about a 45 minute discussion on Parkinson's disease and how we're gonna treat it in the Caribbean. That'll be followed a week later, February 8th, on a talk on ALS. And you can get much more information uh, on these Zoom webinars, signing up for the webinars, and even signing up for the Caribbean clinical trials by going to our website, uh, zgm.care, which has lots of additional information on there. So this is Dr. Jacobs signing off. Hope to see you all in the future. And thank you for your time and attention. Good afternoon.